children how are you i hope you all are studying well so children is in grammar fun we get to learn about so many different different concepts at the same time we also know when to use a certain form okay or part of speech while we are making an attempt to write or speak all right at the same time when we read also something we are able to relate it correct now children let's talk about this another concept that we have already learned for so many years but now we are going to talk about it in more detail after having a brief revision about it all right and this concept is of conjunctions okay so hello kids conjunctions are the words which are used to join words phrases clauses or sentences together so conjunctions kya hote hain in simple words they are joining words और दे आर सेंटेंस कनेक्टर्स बिकॉज वो सेंटेंसेस को कनेक्ट करते हैं या फिर उन्हें ज्वाइन कर देते हैं क्लियर नाउ लेट्स लुक एट द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ कंजंक्शन नाउ देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ कंजंक्शन एक होते हैं कोऑर्डिनेटिंग कंजंक्शन दूसरे होते हैं सबॉर्डिनेटिंग कंजंक्शन और तीसरे होते हैं को रेलेटिव कंजंक्शन नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट कोऑर्डिनेटिंग कंजंक्शन इन डिटेल रीड द फॉलोइंग सेंटेंसेस द सन सेट the birds went into their nests so now these sentences they are independent they are of equal rank or order they do not depend upon each other in any way we use the word and to join such independent sentences to agar aap inko independently dekhoge to bhi uska sense uh, ban raha hai jaise the sun set dusra sentence banta hai the birds went into their nest सो ऐसे सेंटेंसेस को जब हमें ज्वाइन करना होता है सिंपल सेंटेंसेस जिसका सेंस बन रहा है तो हम यूज करते हैं एंड द सन सेट एंड द बर्ड्स वेंट इन टू दर नेस्ट दस एंड इज वॉट इट इज अ कोऑर्डिनेटिंग कंजंक्शन अगेन लुक एट द सेंटेंसेस गिवन बिलो आई कॉल्ड हिम ही डिड नॉट आंसर नाउ लेट एस ज्वाइन दीज इंडिपेंडेंट सेंटेंसेस विद द वर्ड बट मतलब I called him, but he did not answer. Thus, but is also a coordinating conjunction. A co a coordinating conjunction can be defined as one that joins sentences or words of equal rank or order. एक ही rank के हैं या एक ही order के हैं उन उन sentences को join करने के लिए हम use करते हैं coordinating conjunctions. we also call a conjunction coordinating because it joins single words together but these single words must be of the same rank or order thus in the sentence 2 and 2 make 4 and is a coordinating conjunction there are seven coordinating conjunctions these are and but for or nor yet and so so remember all these words they are all coordinating conjunctions now let's look at subordinating conjunctions look at the following sentences lovi has been happy ever her parents came to live with her so we use the word since to join these sentences so lovi has been happy ever since her parents came to live with her thus since is a subordinating conjunction because it joins two sentences which are not of equal rank or order one of the two is dependent upon or subordinate to the other so agar aap ye dekhoge uska uh, individually it is not making any sense okay so iske liye aapko uh, usme aur ek uh, clause dalna padta hai ya conjunction dal ke usko join karenge tab iska pura sentence ka sense banega okay now in the following sentences the conjunction shown in italics are subordinating i am taking a bath because i am feeling very hot so you are giving a clause or you giving a reason for taking a bath he was frightened when he heard the noise did you hear that i have lost my purse i know where he has gone i know what to do now we know when our exams start i told him what happened in the meeting i shall be surprised if you fail i shall not tell him unless he ask me to do so he is contented though 
he is poor. Okay. So, uh, these are all subordinating conjunctions. A subordinating conjunction can be defined as one that joins sentences of different order or different rank, one of them being dependent on the other. So, yaha pe dusre ke upar dependency aa jati hai. Clear? And that's why we join them with certain words like do, unless, if, what, when, what, where, that, okay, because. Clear? Now, let's be smart. Underline the conjunctions in the following sentences and write their kinds. I shall come if I can. So, if kya ho jata hai? If ho jata hai, subordinating conjunction. Okay. I saw my friend as he came in. So, as kya ban jata hai yaha pe? As becomes your coordinating conjunction. Clear? You must do as you like. Okay. So, again, this is a coordinating conjunction. So, quickly do the remaining ones by yourself. Now, let's look at the correlative conjunctions. Correlative conjunctions are pairs of words that help to join two balanced class clauses, phrases or words. Okay. They are used in compound sentences which have cla clauses of equal rank. There are a few conjunctions which are used in pairs such as both and, neither nor, as, as, as many as, rather than, either or, not only but also, such that, no sooner than, whether or. So, such, such conjunctions are said to be correlative to each other. They get their name from the fact that they work together, that is, in, that is co, and relate one sentence element to another. Okay. Now, the conjunctions in the following sentences are correlative to each other. So, these sentences are used in the Okay. We both love and honor him. Either you or I must go. Neither Nikhil nor Jatin broke that window. I don't know whether she is here or not. Not only is he foolish, but also obstinate. He is as cunning as a fox. The boy asked such a foolish question that everybody laughed at him. No sooner had I stepped out than it started raining. She'd rather play the drums than sing. Clear? Now, let's combine these pairs of sentences using suitable correlative conjunctions. You can get a haircut today. You can get a haircut next week. You can either get a haircut today or next week. They had just left our place. It started to rain heavily. Okay. No sooner had they left our place than it started raining. Neera can choose a kitten. She can also choose a dog. Neera can either choose a kitten or a dog. Clear? Now, rest of the sentences you have to do by yourself. Next, given below are some pairs of common correlative conjunctions. Make two sentences with each of them. Okay? So, you have to do all these sentences. Okay? You have words like as, as, both, and. So, these are pretty easy. You have to use your own thinking and make your own sentences. Now note, sometimes words which are not conjunctions also do the same work. For example, the relative pronouns who, which and that do this joining work. Yesterday I met Sonam who has grown quite tall. So conjunction ke words nahi hue, to bhi relative pronouns jo hote, jase who, which, that, we can use them. The crow dropped the cheese which the fox immediately snapped up. He lived near a tank. That was a nuisance. Clear? So, children, remember all these points in your, it has to be fixed in your memory. Okay? All these points, all these things, all these rules you must remember and accordingly apply them. It's pretty easy and you can use them while speaking also with others. Alright? So, quickly complete the exercises and don't forget to revise the chapter. <laughs>